Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel and for this video, I will be teaching you how to do the setup for Comfast CF EW73 360 degrees 300 Mbps. So disclaimer lang, hindi ako mateki na tao. I am not used to this kind of work but since I have my PISO Wi-Fi business, I also need to be aware on the technicalities of this uh, business. So that's why I research in the internet, in Google, in YouTube on how to do the setup and many more. So earlier, kaninang umaga, dumating na yung order ko galing NCR and in order ko to sa Shopee. So the price of this is about 1,913 including na yung uh, shipping fee. So sa ngayon, I want to do the setup for bridging for the first time. I believe na tayo mak makakapag setup nito as long as we follow some steps in the internet or in YouTube. So ngayon, uh, we need to unbox this package. So ito yung nasa loob. So may uh, bubble wrap siya which is good kasi uh, it will protect the product inside. So we need to tear this bubble wrap. So, ito na yung product. This is Comfaz Outdoor High Power Wireless AP300 Mbps and it can accommodate up to 76 uh, users. So, this is the model CFEW73. So, it is really uh, fully secured. So, you don't need to, to worry about the shipping kasi napaka fully secured ng uh, product nila. So, yun. So, ito yung nasa loob. Ito yung pinaka-antena niya. It is in a cylindrical shape. So, nandito yung mga indicator kapag merong signal or kapag merong uh, power sa antena. And dito, we have here, um, this is the cable. Maybe for this tutorial purposes, I will be using this one. But uh, later sa labas, I will be using the long cable na. And it has... Mm, I didn't expect this one. Because it has this power supply. I thought they will just deliver the antenna lang. So we have here the power supply. At least I have some reserves. Kasi actually... I already bought another one of this before kasi nasira nga yung sa uh, vendo ko so at least they have this one para meron pa akong reserva so I will just keep this one by the way I already have the power supply this is very important para magkaroon ng power yung antenna natin then ito ito na yung mga uh, pampasecure sa antena and ilalagay natin ito mamaya sa uh, mismong body ng antena then ito yung mga screw to be used uh, later yan okay we will open this now yan then we will put this to dito So, make sure it is properly attached to the body of this antenna. Yan. So, ayan na. And after this, we will be attaching now the cable to the bottom part of this antenna. Yan. So, bali ito yung um, power supply. Bali ito yung slot para sa antena. Then, ito yung para sa internet. So, ang isa nito, ipapasok natin dito sa... This is POE. Ganyan. That is POE. So, we will 
uh, attach this one here. Yan. Then yung kabila dito sa bottom ng antena natin. So we need to open this. So meron siyang support dito sa baba. Then uh, we will insert this one sa bottom part. Yan. So fully secured na siya. So later if we will put this outside, so we need to put back the uh, support. Ito try natin kung gumagana ba yung antena natin. So we need power, so kailangan isaksak sa outlet. So as you can see, meron siyang ilaw. So this is working. And we will just wait for like 10 to 15 minutes para ma-fully uh, stabilize yung system. So, okay guys, so set up it natin. So, I will be using my cell phone. So, let's go to the Wi-Fi. So, ito yung mga nasagap na Wi-Fi. So, ngayon, ito yung piece of Wi-Fi ko, Iskulano underscore Wi-Fi Vendo. And ito yung, yung antena kanina, yung Comfast B890 underscore uh, 2G. So, we will connect first to that uh, Wi-Fi dito sa Comfast. Yan, hintayin na natin. So, after ma-connect guys, we will go to 192.168.10.1. That's the IP address. So, we will type that here in our uh, browser. So, I will be using uh, Chrome. So, we have 192. 192. That one six eight. That one six eight. Then that ten. That one. So that is the IP address one nine two. That one six eight. That ten. That one. Then go. So this is now the portal of the Comfast, and as you can see, it is in Chinese, but we could. Change this one to English. Ito lang. You click this. Itong parang may globe sa bottom right. Then, click uh, English. So, the default password is admin. So, we type admin. Yan. Then, login. So, bali, ito na yung home niya. Dito, uh, you have the status, the wizard, the network, uh, the users, then the system. So, ito yung nakapaloob sa status, yung kanina. Then, for the wizard, ito yung mga pwedeng gawin nyo. Merong router, merong for the bridge, merong uh, access point or the APN. Sa baba, you have the repeater. Yan, that is for the wizard. Then, for the network, so we have here the LAN wireless. And for the users... So, this is the content of the users. Then, for the system, we have the manage configuration, reboot, or you may change your password, LED switch, then time setting. So, yun. Before natin set up yung uh, bridge, uh, we will go first to the network. Ito, network, then uh, you tap wireless. Then, you click the advanced setting. Yan. Then after that, we need to on the isolate. Bakit kailangan yung on ang isolate? Kasi yan yung nakita kong step na dapat mong gawin before you set up something dito sa uh, Comfast. So turn it on. Then apply. So we will just wait this na mag uh, confirm. Okay. 
Okay na? So actually guys, you can use your laptop para mas malaki. But in this case, I will be using my handphone lang para mas madali. So we will go now to wizard. And we will going to select the bridge. Select the bridge. Then uh, tap the next button. Then we need to scan SSID. Kasi we need to find that Escolano underscore Wi-Fi vendor. This one. So, ito yung result after scanning. Then, then we are going to select this number 3. Escolano underscore Wi-Fi uh, vendor. You just tap this icon, yung sa gilid. Yan. Then, I also want to copy this. Kasi yun yung gagamitin kong name or SS SSID name sa other antenna ko. Itong compass na antenna. Then next. So I will be changing this compass underscore B8090 underscore 2G to Escolano underscore Wi-Fi vendor. So kindly delete this. Then paste. Yan. So next. Then finish. So we will just wait this to confirm. So napansin nyo automatic wala na siyang internet. Kasi nga nagtransfer na yung uh, wifi bale dun sa a uh, Wi-Fi vendor ko. So we will find that. So let's go back to the Wi-Fi. Then wala na yung uh, compass. So we have already this is Colano underscore uh, Wi-Fi. Then click this. So this is now the portal. And I still have 35 minutes and 19 seconds. So let's try. If makakonek ng internet. So meron ng internet. Then let's go to YouTube. How about this? Okay guys, so that's it. So successful natin na set up yung bridging ng ating compass. And later, I will be putting this sa likod ng bahay namin. So that our neighbor in that other side, we're going to benefit our uh, PISO Wi-Fi. Before I'm going to end this video pala guys, just for us to make sure na dalawa na yung um, antenna for the Escolano underscore Wi-Fi vendor, let's go to this um, Wi-Fi analyzer. And let's see if nasagap na niya yung isang antenna. So let's go to this. So napansin niyo dalawa na siya. So ito yung isa, ito yung uh, pangalawa. Then if we try to find it sa ating graph. So ito. So dalawa na yung antenna for my piso Wi-Fi. I hope you learned something from this video. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe to my channel. Click the bell button for notification. If you have comments, suggestions, or recommendations, you may write them in the comment section below. So, see you in my next uh, video. Bye-bye.